Dawson City. And we're just doing a walk through. Everything seems to be closed. We'll return it. Oh, this one's for sale too. Yeah, so. Yeah, we'll do a panorama. So we got some stores. This is sort of like a stretch bucket for the stretchers. These are the buckets. Just gonna walk around a little bit. Maybe we'll see Parker Schnovel or somebody. <laughs> That'd be funny. Wait, wait, wait. He actually. Um, there's a boat behind me right there. That's a, one of the river boats that would go. Water. Are we gonna go in the water? We go down to Whitehorse, I guess. Yeah, Um, when yeah, we did. We we found so many fun things here. It was worth it, but we have to drive a few more hours back that way, the like way we came from. So. Hmm. Right? Yeah. Oh yeah, and I got the So we are only staying, we stayed a few hours. And I think we got to see and experience um, a little bit. So we're gonna head off. Maybe find Tony Beats's operation, which is actually just down the road. This takes you to the Northwest Territories, all the way up to in Nunavik, where you could put your toes in the Arctic Circle. We're gonna cross the bridge, and it's an old wooden bridge, and we're gonna cross it. It looks like they're doing maintenance on it. Here we are, we're gonna cross the old wooden bridge across the Yukon River. the Dempster Highway. It is not paved. It's all gravel road and you have to be you have to come prepared with full tires, gas, everything. It is a long ways up north. And here's the Dempster Highway. There we are. Alright, so the Watson clan has made it to Carcross. Hey Sophie, we made it to Carcross. Carcross Desert. 
and it's the only dunes in Canada. We're gonna go climb some dunes, I think, eh? This is just amazing. This uh, desert. If it wasn't for some of the mountains, you would think you were somewhere else. Like the Sahara Desert. Kids are way up in front of me. Mama and the other one is behind me. So way up there somewhere, that's Dakota and Savannah, and we're going to hike up to that dune. But are we going all the way up? Oh yeah, got to get a good view of it. Hey, oh eh? got to get a good view. And then off that way is more dunes. So technically... Can I leave my shoes right here? Science, no, Forgot. Scientifically, Sophie says this isn't a beach. This is. I mean, not a beach. <laughs> <laughs> Can you cut that out? <laughs> this isn't a desert. She this says. isn't a desert. This isn't a beach. There's no water. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Scientifically speaking, <laughs> it's a desert. Uh, not a desert. <laughs> it's an anonymously. It's a. It's a geographic. Anonymally. And it's so weird because we're up in the mountains at Emerald Lake and it was cool. But you can really feel the uh, the heat in the sand. And of course we are walking barefoot. Because if you're gonna experience walking in a desert, you gotta do it barefoot. I'm going with you got it, you gotta go. Nope. The sink in the sand will lose you. No, not good. This just blows me away. Hey, Mama? Yes. Definitely weird. Okay, I gotta pause. Well, made it to the top of Car, car Cross Desert. I am winded. It is a long. It's a long walk up here, Dakota. Yes! Sammy, tell you some. Right, so let's give them a view. I know I did that. And Sophia is with Sophia's not blocked on. You know? Oh, they kind of can see the black. Oh, 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 that's all I'm doing. Tired. When I was walking up here, yeah. I didn't expect any like there was a dragonfly in that bush when I walked up here. When it started to fly, I thought it was something like like a bee or wasp or something else. Yeah. So it's it gave me. Yeah, it gave me a little bit of scare. Yeah, and I um, mostly um my heart skipped a 